Especially with the hype surrounding around Floor 2 and the major update coming out relatively soon for Roblox doors, this also means new maps and rooms are pretty much guaranteed to come with some major changes. We'll be going over some insane new maps and room concepts for Roblox doors in this one, so suggest more map ideas down below because, well, the developers are watching, and you could be lucky as well. Incredibles, a co-developer of Roblox Doors, posted several weeks back within the Splash Discord server, there is a new map that is to come for this upcoming Floor 1 revamp update called the Infirmary. But how about we take this picture and make it come to life? Yes. I was actually able not only to recreate the room using Roblox Doors assets, but I was also able to extend it beyond the leak image and Except to the walls, the beds, and some very minor touches, everything is pretty much up to scale and should be placed perfectly according to the leaked image. There are a few major things to talk about though, such as this very weird door that seems to have a skeleton head or white mask on it. Not sure if this would be a room where players would go in for a surprise, such as a room in order to get an item, but it is a very interesting approach. As for the rest of the room, plenty of cabinets in order to gather even more items from, especially when it comes to more hospital related stuff such as a boosted chance of vitamins and bandages, as well as some wardrobes for hiding and many obstacles such as random crates, briefcases and carts will be in your way as well. Huh? Of course, players will most likely be able to hide underneath the beds just like in normal rooms, so there will be plenty of hiding spots for even large parts parties playing. But overall, I'm definitely looking forward to this new infirmary room once it comes out pretty soon. This next new map model was created by I'm Not Gnome and I'm proud of myself A on Roblox and they had an interesting idea of bringing in food into the mix along with Roblox doors. They actually ended up making a giant cafeteria styled room within the Doors RP game and this does bring in a ton of amazing ideas that the game could use for newer maps coming in. Just the sheer layout of all these tables creates a big filling experience that this place was once very popular and widely used. And the placement of the front counters fully fitted with typewriters and bells mimics that used at fast food restaurants as well. Now the menu is super sus, such as uh, screech eat? Ambush eat? I literally thought that it said meat for a second. That would have been really bad. But the room continues into the back where it leads into a kitchen slash prepping area which could be led into the next room if implemented. Now granted, this is just a concept, but the developers could use this idea and turn it into a grand dining hall type of sorts, which would be an amazing idea, especially for a future room. But that's not all. I'm Not Gnome ended up creating yet another amazing masterpiece, and you won't believe this one. They ended up creating a legitimate hospital concept room that is also inspired by Roblox doors. Fully equipped with a rating room that does feature many sofas and chairs along the room, a staff room that could hold a locked door forcing players to find a key to progress, and of course, many of the hospital rooms throughout the hallway where the players would have to find that key in order to open that locked staff room. At the end of the hallway, a water spill could be found with a caution sign, which could lead to a hazard such as slipping and losing health if you walk over it, but overall, this would be a very interesting concept and a big change when it comes to the design and the style of the game. This next one was created by Doors Fan Dove, and though simple, it does feature a cool concept and design idea as well. This room is known as Silence's Room, named after the entity concept called Silence, and it's basically a black voided room that does feature several door assets floating around like sofas and wardrobes. Though simple, this idea could be used for a future entity, especially one that has supernatural powers. It kind of resembles that of the floating bridge by the lobby's front doors inside of the spawning area, so this could be a well-related concept to explain what's going on with that supernatural force. But how about an even better version of this map? 
A guy who makes games ended up creating this room concept of also a silence hallway room, but this one features some pretty creepy glitchy lights and even some more of those floating acids as well. Though it is a bit too big and roomy, this is another version from the previous concept. But enough with those, how about revamping one of the most peaceful rooms within the game with a totally new concept at the same time? That's right. The courtyard. I'm sure we all can agree that the game could use some more outside type of rooms, so in a blink of an eye, let's turn the courtyard into a hedge maze. Voila! Looks pretty nice! While also using Roblox store assets, I was able to revamp the courtyard into a maze that features four quadrants into the area, each housing an archway that leads to a couple trees that could contain a key, because of course, there is a door that is locked requiring you to go through the maze in order to find it. Many obstacles will be in your way, such as crates blocking routes, but you may be lucky to find some compartments to help aid in your journey. Not only would it be a fun puzzle type of room to go through, but with the outside ambiance, it would bring in more variety for the game at the same time. Be careful though! This one is going to be very scary as it was created by a user called Heckware. But they were able to create a very eerie new map concept showcasing the super abandoned parts of the Roblox Doors Hotel. Not only is it very foggy within the rooms, but the desolate feeling along with the creepy ambiance just seems to take things to a whole new level complete with a semi-working staircase which could give ideas of adding two or even three floored rooms just like room 100 but what's even crazier is that there is a deep basement to this map that honestly just gives me chills down my spine man it leads to a dead end room with some scrap but this could give the developers some insane inspirations on making some huge rooms out there in the future though so, this could more or less be used as an ending boss room more than anything. Also, made by the same person, Hackwire, this concept of having endless rooms looping over and over again could be a cool room idea as well, especially as it forces the player to find a secret button or something in order to deactivate the sequence. We've seen this happen in other games, most notably Super Mario 64 with that endless staircase, but the same stuff could be applied to doors as inspiration, which could be a cool touch. We've also seen concepts on this idea made by several players within the community, and the developers themselves even said that it was an interesting idea, so it could theoretically happen. You never know. But what new map would you suggest Roblox Doors add in? Let us know down below, and who knows? You could be lucky and have your idea added in.